Here they come. It's something that takes patience. Within the, the hour, you'll have quite a few more. Waiting for bighorn sheep to make their way into Hemingway Park in Boulder City. But during the summer, they rarely disappoint. It's incredible. And for Kevin Flake and his family, a sight that never gets old. Words can hardly describe it. It's so cool. Today, visitors are joined by Doug Nielsen with the Nevada Department of Wildlife, monitoring the herd from a safe distance. This is kind of like putting Dairy Queen in the middle of a college campus, you know? And, and it doesn't take them too long to figure out where it's at. But just this week, pneumonia was reported in bighorn sheep in nearby Zion National Park. Hikers asked to report any sheep seen coughing the same disease that spread through Nevada sheep just a few years ago. Nielsen says the population here is still recovering. There's no natural antibodies for it. They don't have a natural protection and there's nothing that we can do for them. And uh, if it goes into full-blown pneumonia, it can, and in this case has, have a significant impact on the herd. A few generations wiped out. The sight of a lamb today, a good sign. Surrounded by the lake and development, this mountain range near the park has become somewhat of an island, preventing the sheep from migrating great distances. But incredibly, over the last 50 years, statewide, the herd is doing much better. And one reason, man's intervention, conservation efforts and roundups like this one from 2007, removing sheep from one range in Clark County to repopulate other areas up north. Today, as many as 12,000 bighorn sheep roam the Nevada range. During the 1960s, that number was less than 3,000. They're an economic boom because we have tourists um, organizations that stop here with their tour groups. We have people who travel a long way across the country because they've heard of Hemingway Park. And so for Boulder City, it's an important part of the, the community, really. And Flake would agree. I mean, there's some uh, matriarch type ones too with the big horns. All it takes is patience and remembering to keep your distance from the sheep in the park. Denise Roche, News 3.